Frank Tuner turns. And Keith Wood has a, a personal contretemps with Philippe Benetton. No doubting that, and I think uh, there could be serious trouble here. Well, we've got one of the most experienced referees on the world on the touchline, and we can't have failed. Jim Flanning can't have failed to see what happened there. Well, it was, I'd have said, as blatant as can be. You'll see now, there's the initial impact of Keith Wood, who's hurled to the ground. Up goes Benetton, in goes the punch. And I would have thought, marching orders. Well, if, if, if these three can't sort it out, nobody can. It looks obvious that Keith Wood seems to be quite hurt there. What seemed like a fairly, it was a fairly robust challenge, all right, to say the least. Um, it all depends on how Jim Fleming read that situation. Jim Fleming, the touch set on this near side from Scotland. Peter Marshall. And uh, Philippe Bernard Salle is being given the yellow card. Well, I'm afraid that surely is misidentification. Uh, total, I mean, it, you have I to mean, say that maybe evidence of video playback would have sorted that situation out very quickly because from us sitting up here, it was, it was clear well, as no day question, exactly what happened. No question at all. I just think, I mean, Benetton. Uh, ben Arsal says, uh, what, me? I mean, I don't think he's involved. Anyway, a yellow card for the luckless winger. No doubt about who this was. And no doubt about what he did either. But he's still on the field and untainted.